day 29 I can see the finish line in sight uh, it's black leather jacket but to be honest if it was a race I think I've been running the wrong way for most of it black leather jacket I used to have one of those look like a right tool <laughs> right I got to the point where I'm gonna try and play with the band let's see what we can do That's it. Um, quite like the rhythm of this one. It's quite cool. But uh, um, the song, when he explains it during the lesson, he doesn't tell you anything about the strum pattern. And I find that is a big deal through this course. Is another thing I'd say that um, maybe they do if you've got all the written literature with it, but he doesn't talk anything about it, so maybe they don't. And he just seems to think that rhythm comes naturally when you're playing. Well, for me, it definitely doesn't. And it hasn't since I started uh, my whole journey, really. Um, so I think there'd be better to have some explanation there. I did look online to try and find a strum pattern, there wasn't any, so I'm just trying to basically go off what they've got here. Uh, when they're playing with the band, it actually differs from when he plays on his own. Um, just on not Keith, sorry, the the other guy in this part of this band, he plays on his own just with the acoustic, and he plays the plays it slightly differently there as well. So there's not a lot of consistency. It doesn't give me confidence when I'm going in to play it, but something just to be aware of if you're going to check these um, lessons out anyway. But um, that's it for lesson 21, uh, the penultimate lesson, and um, I hope I'll catch you in the next one. Cheers.